Hi everybody, how's it going? Welcome back to Back to the Future Part 4, the multitasking crystal for more indie point and click adventure game action. We are right back where we left off on the world from Dune. Uh, we flew up here using the shuttle bug and we're going to hopefully visit some of the other areas that are now opened up to us and find out how to solve some more of these puzzles um, and potentially get some crystal shards and things. I think that was what Dr. Edison said we needed to do, wasn't it? So uh, we're going to I think leave this world because it looks like we can't really do anything else here but first if you haven't already done so make sure you hit that subscribe button and the notification bell down below the video so you get a notification to your device every time i upload and as always guys thank you all for your ongoing support so we've got super frog we've got zool we've got project x but i want to go to this the united planet ship the avalon one okay what is this there's a hatch there's an exit there. Uh, it doesn't look like there's an awful lot here we can do other than potentially open this hatch. It's blocked. Oh. Okay. Um, do we have anything that can let us in there? Maybe the wrench thing? Doesn't seem to work. Uh, okay. I love the music. Screwdriver. Ah, I think that's worked. There we go. It's a combat suit. Amazing. A combat suit. Huh. Whoa. It's a futuristic armor. Turrican suit. And there's a Turrican assault rifle as well. Holy crap. What is that for? I think that's literally all we can do here. Okay, let's leave. Uh, what can we do with Zool? And Project X, or can we not do anything? The Super Frog? No, it doesn't look like we can do anything. Can we do anything back here? Maybe in the cave, now that we've got this armour? No. Doesn't look like we can use this suit. Um, so let's try. We can't. We can't even like click on this assault rifle. And there's this painting, but there's nothing else here, is there? No. Okay. So it doesn't look like we can actually do anything to Zool or Project X or Super Frog. So I don't know if they're just there for some sort of other reason. We can't shoot them by the looks of things. Um, I don't know. It's odd, isn't it? Can we... Can we use the laxative on Super Frog if he comes back? Doesn't look like he's coming back. Okay, I don't know what that's about, to be honest. Um, so, we're back on Earth. Let's go into the Chrono John again. Because I had a bit of an idea. I don't know if this is going to work, but I had a little idea for... Uh, this little dinosaur set. We also, there's this cave that we, we can't actually seem to go in, which is odd. It's empty. Okay. So there's nothing in there. Why is it even there, then? There was the bird, wasn't there? There's nothing to do with the bird. There was this dinosaur. Um, and I was thinking, maybe we can feed it the hamburger. But maybe we have to put the laxatives onto the hamburger. There we go. Right. I knew it. Okay, so now if we put this in the tube, will this work? Yes! <laughs> there we go. Uh, it's still alive, but we've got this crystal shard. So this must be one of the crystal shards that Dr. Edison was talking about. Mull. There are some engraved letters. M-U-L. OK. 
Okay, is there anything else here? No. I actually sort of half figured that puzzle out on my way to work this morning. <laughs> I was walking along thinking about this game and I was thinking, how can we possibly use the laxatives on that dinosaur? And I thought, you know, pouring laxatives into that tube isn't going to make him drink it, is it? So we'll have to put it on some food. So I thought, I'll get home and I'll record the next episode and I'll try pouring it on the hamburger. And it turns out it's worked, which is pretty cool. Um, do we give this to Dr. Fred? No. Okay. So I think that's probably all we can do for for now from here. Um, do we put the crystals on the moon? Or do we put them on Stonehenge or something? Maybe we need this to take on that big boss at the end. Maybe that's the point of getting that. We shall see, I suppose. All right, let's fly up to the moon. I mean, we can try using the crystal shard on the machine while we're here. But I don't know if it'll work. We'll try it anyway. Okay, we'll try it on this machine. No, it doesn't work. Okay, scrap that idea. And we'll go back to Stonehenge and see if it works down there. Uh, down this way. Okay, Stonehenge, let's fly down to there. In your own time, E.T., come on. It's not like we're waiting for anything. Okay, so th this was the altar stone, wasn't it? I was thinking that maybe the crystal shards go on this. Yeah, it looks like they, they do. It's gone back into Italian. <laughs> um, right, so it looks like we need some more shards then. And I'm thinking there's probably two places that one could be. One could be in 2140 here. Um, there's that locked that locked place in here, isn't there? And then there's also that one with, with the car where they had the the room we couldn't get into that had an electronic lock or something. I don't know if we maybe have a way of getting into that now, but we can check that another time. So yeah, there's this wardrobe which is locked. Okay, can we use the key? I mean, it's unlikely, but no, it doesn't seem to work. Can we shoot it open? It could, could be. No, it doesn't seem to work. Okay, um, so we need, we need something to get in there. That is for sure. Let's go back out. Um, there was nothing else around here or anything. I don't think. Let's just make sure there's no areas we can. Go to. Oh, it's a key! Haha, <laughs> there's a key! What is that? The hell is that? That's the weirdest looking key I've ever seen. I wonder if that's the key for the wardrobe. Let's try it. Yes, it is! Okay, what do we have in the wardrobe? A crystal shard! <laughs> okay, this one is TI. <gasps> So, we now have an MUL and a TI. Multi. Multi. Okay, let's go back. Let's go to... Was there anything in 1899? I'm going like, to properly search the floor now after that. It was the time machine, but we took the diamond from that, didn't we? No, There's nothing here, I don't think. Nothing there. Can't do anything to the moon. I think I think we have got everything from here. So let's go back to 1985. Was there anything this way? No. Right. Let's go back to the altar stone. Let's put this one on here. Okay. So I guess we're going to need tasking as well. So we've got multi. We're going to need tasking. So, um, how do we get to? out of this area. 
You have to actually fly back to the moon and then do it that way. It's a little bit annoying, actually. <laughs> so in terms of places we can go to now, I mean, really, the only thing that I can think of off the top of my head is that place that we got to by using... I can't even remember what method of time travel it was now. Was it... Was it the DeLorean? I think it was the DeLorean, wasn't it? The place with the car where we took the charged battery, which I still have no idea what we've got to do with. Um, right. So, we've got this suit, though. Maybe that can help us. Possibly. We'll go to New York. I wonder if Doc and that are back in New York now, actually. Maybe that's worth checking out. No, they're not. So they're not back in this lab. So where the hell have the Doc and everyone gone? Because they weren't in the mansion anymore, were they? We can't use the battery on the Ecto-1, can we? No. Okay, let's use the DeLorean. We'll do a quick sort of check on the time periods from the DeLorean then. And other than that, I'm sort of... Where was it? Was it... 2008 yeah this is it um, so there's the Ferrari 288 GTO we can't do anything with it I just have got a car okay I mean this we can't use this space suit or anything on it can we no um, I've still got the death certificate and everything so it was this door wasn't there and then there's this keypad with numeric code. So we need to know a code. Twelve hundred's not going to work again, is it? No. Huh? I wonder how we're going to find out a code for this door. We definitely haven't seen any others. I can't open it. There are no handles. Does that potentially mean we could get a handle? Hmm. There's nothing else here. Okay. So it doesn't look like we can do much here. There's got to be something we can do. We need that code. We've got to get that code somehow. Let's go to... 701, because I'm not convinced we did everything here. Let's go towards the prison. There was that floor we could fly over. Unless, of course, that is it. And There was the lethal trap. We can interact with that somehow. I don't know why, but we can definitely do something to it. Hmm. It's um Yeah, it's a little bit a little bit all up in the air at the moment. There must be something that we've missed somewhere. I couldn't tell you what it is. Um should we go to thirty eight? did everything there didn't we I don't think there was much here we, we must have done everything in Venice it can't be here okay let's go back to somewhere else then let's go to 93 let's just do it in time order Detroit there wasn't an awful lot in Detroit was there no this is where we had Robocop and everything I'm pretty sure we did all we could here can we go this way No, not a lot we can do there. Okay, what about the next place? Los Angeles. This is where we got the 3D printed mask. We can still use this, interestingly. We can still use this. Okay, but there's nothing else we can do here. Let's try Los Angeles. Uh, sorry, New York. This is where Gizmo originally was from, isn't it? Anything else we can do here? Nothing to do with that sign. There's no other area. Um, no, nothing. 
I have no idea. So nothing there. So we've been to that place. Right, let's go to 97. So we've got... What do we have here? Stairs? Let's, let's just go everywhere. We're going to have to go everywhere. We must have missed something crucial. Um, anything in here? There was this TV, wasn't there? How did we watch that again? Wasn't it just some random program? Like, some random crappy program? Do we even have the controls? Yeah. But we'd lost them then. I don't know if this is just an easter egg. This is Laurie Amour. Zack won the Nobel Peace Prize for the world. Then he won the Pulitzer for writing a book about it. The Coed Spring Break became their big break. A famous movie produced, starred the box, that's just Mars Need Men, blah blah blah. The people of Earth rapidly regained their former level of intelligence and traded in good karma for the latest food fad, two-headed squirrel burgers. What on earth? No one trusted the phone company anymore. A telepathic conversations dream show became the norm at $2.50 for the first three minutes after 11. What on earth? And now, in the most anticipated concert of the year, the Diamond Eyes singer awaits you numerous. I'll be there, you can't miss it. I don't understand what's happened. No, neither do I. I have no flipping idea what that was about. I don't even know if it's relevant in any way. It's pretty bizarre. Uh, okay. So there was that. There's the door here. Uh, what's all this crap? See, there's, there's numbers here, but I don't think any of these are going to relate to a code. What was this? This was just locked or something, wasn't it? Closed, work in progress, fair enough. Um, 14th Avenue, let's try there again. May as well. Lose Loans was here, wasn't it? Anything in Lose Loans? Anything at all? shopkeepers here. I mean, can we talk to him? No. We've got the guitar. We can't pick up the collectible thing anymore. There's literally nothing we can do here. I'm going to have to try it and error it. There's got to be a way of getting this code. I just can't think of what it would be. I haven't seen any codes anywhere. What's this golden gate thing? Oh yeah, we've been here before. This is where we got the, the shuttle bug thing, wasn't it? There's nothing down here. Hmm. The mystery deepens. The mystery deepens. Let's go back to the 13th Avenue then. I don't suppose there's a... Now these can't be they, these are numbers perhaps it could be one of those but I just I don't see why it would be one of those there's no relevance to those numbers uh, that was 97 yeah see 2008's the next one 288 it's not going to be 288 is it let's try 288 for the number of the Ferrari Two eight eight. No. Hmm. I mean, I've literally, I've literally seen nothing that would suggest a code, other than those door numbers. But it, I don't get why it would be the door numbers. There's nothing to to sort of give a clue to say that that's what they are. So, I honestly don't know. We've got two crystals, or true crystal shards. What's this sheet of paper? Only dates and places, yeah, but none of them are... 
None of them are relevant. Uh, let's go to the Bermuda Triangle. We haven't been here for a while. Let's see if we can find anything good here. Do we have anything that will allow us to go in the water yet? Oh! We do! Apparently that's a diving suit of some sort. There we go. We're underwater. And that, guys, is where we'll leave it then. Wow, that was a massive fluke, wasn't it? But yeah, turns out that's why we needed that suit. It's a diving suit. <laughs> so there we go. So in the next one, we will explore this little underwater area and see what this is all about. Uh, but that does it for this one. So as always, guys, thank you very much for watching. <laughs> I'm sort of throwing my hands up in the air here, a little bit confused, but we figured it out <laughs> accidentally. Um, so yeah, if you enjoyed the video, click on that like button. It really does help the channel to grow, so I do appreciate it. Make sure you hit that subscribe button and the notification bell if you're new, or just haven't already done so. And I'll see you all next time. <laughs>